Ladies and gentlemen, and only people over the age of 13, <laughs> welcome to today's advent calendar. I need to come up with a new intro because of Kappa. Anyways, just sitting around, I again did nothing today, but that's because the day I essentially went to visit my aunt. So again, just kind of uh, basically she, my aunt visited my mom and dad, came back up here. She, mom had some presents that need to go to my brother, who's coming down here on the 21st. So I got them from my aunt and give them to my brother. So anyways, and all that, just in general, it's been ages since, again, saw my aunt. So we had dinner and hung out. So again, I did nothing around the house, but I did get some shopping done, quote unquote. Uh, this is stuff I ordered from uh, Amazon. So I'm getting uh, some, this is for one of my ne nieces. This is for my nephew. He's getting something else also. I forget what. And then I have some cameras that I ordered for the two oldest. Figures about right age to get them some nice digital cameras to take pictures. Even though everyone can do it with the phone nowadays. Anyways, so anyways, I should make this quick. My This is running out of uh, power. So, oh, also I found this guy. What I mean by this guy, I mean this frame here, but I couldn't find a cabling that went with it. It's a a housing case so this seals up here and supplies power you can plug it in etc cetera, etc cetera. so i just bought this i didn't need the case but i need the wire so it was only like 10 bucks anyway so this guy here the old one i'm going now officially how long have I been saying this hang it up outside take uh, some st uh time lapse photography so so that's it that's all i really done today i did shopping yesterday and it's already here I, again, I don't like ordering uh, next day on Amazon. It unnecessarily makes people hurry. And usually they're underpaid people that have to hurry. But it was no other option. So so I have to wrap these up as well as, again, the gifts that come in the next couple days. Also, I have to finish planning out all my projects I'm going to do magically with only $200. So <laughs> anyways, enough about that. That's the future. Who knows what it holds psychics maybe but eh, they don't tell us how come no psychics ever win the lottery anyways all that aside today we're looking at oh, i still got a my cut there anyways let me use it with my hand that doesn't have a giant scar in it uh frankly organic this one is pomegranate and lemon so again uh, organic vodka i didn't say what kind of vodka though right uh, real ingredients, shake well to enjoy. And again, one of you wants to actually have like a nutritional facts on back. Uh, corn is made with corn vodka. Uh, corn vodka, comma, pomegranate, comma, 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 chameleon. Uh, pomegranate juice, organic lemon juice, organic ginger root, that's new. Uh, turmeric root, uh, maca root. Uh, coconut sugar and other flavorings so it lists more than i thought it would so there we go i ooh, no one had told you that i can you see that there is stuff in there i can actually see that that is a bit unsettling there huh well we'll see what it looks like when i pour it because it actually is stuff in there there we go See if you can see that was well, actually like flakes and stuff floating in it. Interesting. Hmm. It said shake well, and I thought I did. One of that sugar grain or <laughs> uh, tamarack root. Anyways. Ooh, wow. That wow. That smells good. Uh, palm grand juice it smells like palm grand juice. Uh, there's no smell of alcohol, but it's vapory in smell. So it's pomegranate juice if it was vapor. Anyways, but I mean, some smells you can't smell it. All you can smell is just that pure pomegranate juice, like the palm stuff that I get on the road. I don't like it by itself, but I get the pure pomegranate juice and then I mix it with uh, iced tea. So, wow, that smells delicious. But anyways, uh, here's two. Finally getting the shopping done, or more likely, how about meeting relatives you haven't seen in a good while. So here's the family, uh, surprise family get-togethers with relatives you don't see often. There you go. Ooh. 
Ooh. Wow. Almost made me forgot I was drinking some solid objects. <laughs> I mean, you can still see some flakes in there. Where are you? You're right there. Don't know that. Again, I miss having the, my uh, camera, my phone show me what you're seeing. It doesn't do it while recording, so I can't see a live feed. But anyways, delicious. Quite literally very good. Uh, what was the alcohol content? I should have checked. 30% um, by volume, 60 proof. So that's two knocks, essentially 10% less than your standard 40, 80 proof. Your standard spirit line of normal vodka. But that was delicious. Okay, goes in. And the first taste is, again, that palm pomegranate juice is spot on. It tastes like that, not as sweet, and there's something off about it. Again, it's the alcohol. But there's no warmth, there's no alcohol taste yet. You just have this good kind of uh, pomegranate juice taste. Then as it goes down in the vacuum, there's a little bit of warmth, but then it's quickly gone. And again, it's like a little... Hey, we're here, but we got to go. It's just a, a quick little introduction and back. Because then, as it goes down, you still have that taste after that little flush of warm and then politely shows itself out. Ooh. <clears throat> that burp had no taste. I was expecting more pomegranate goodness. But that, again, I remember long ago when I tried the other one, it wasn't too bad. It wasn't as flavorful as this was. This was much more flavorful. So again, my first thought, as I said, I get that palm stuff, mix it with tea. This would go, actually, the pomegranate side of it would go well with the tea. I don't know how the vodka would mix with the tea, but yeah, essentially, again, vodka is a nice mixing alcohol because of its lack of taste, again, by law. Uh, but when you want a little bit of taste with the alcohol, mix this in. Screwdriver. Again, the one thing I know about vodka. Orange juice, palm garden, and lemon. But, and yeah, so this would actually be perfect for those uh, screwdrivers in the morning. But um, yeah, otherwise mix that with tea. Or any other kind of uh, alcohol drink you want to mix, a uh, vodka drink. Because again, it does actually have a s fairly strong pomegranate, uh, I always say that wrong, but whatever, a uh, pomegranate taste. So again, similar to pa uh, Palm Wow, whatever it's called. The, is it Palm Love? Anyways, the uh, pomegranate juice I know we see here in the States. Again, I mix it with iced tea, which is a perfectly mixable drink with this. So... Wow, that's actually really good. And again, the alcohol, There's, I, if I didn't mention it, it was smooth. There was no cringe or anything or warmth. It was actually a fairly smooth alcohol, which again, the last one was smooth too. This was corn. So yeah, interesting. Between this and the Kettle One, I wonder if I don't, if it's just that I don't like the vodka made with wheat versus potato or uh, corn. Actually, crunk. Uh, the stuff I tried before was made with grapes, and that tasted pretty good too. So, hmm. Interesting, because I wonder if it's just wheat I don't like in alcohol. Eh. I doubt it, because I'm pretty sure most whiskeys are made with kind of, if not wheat, uh, rye, mm. or some other kind of grains. So, Oof. Anyways, before this thing runs out of power, let me end the video here. So tomorrow is a whole new day. Uh, hopefully, I'll be doing something. Uh, maybe starting a project, maybe continuing with the yard work to get more uh, scrapes and scars on me. So yeah, fun times. Anyways, all that aside, whew. tell me, do you like palm garden? How? Because again, that's might be... More, uh, I, I see it as an American thing, but that's back in Middle East, uh, Mesopotamia is, I mean, that's a desert plant from back then, so it should be widespread. Anyways, and also, like, I never knew you eat the seed. I didn't know what you ate in pomegranate. I just knew it as a juice or stuff you mix in with tea. So, speaking of which, I need to make my own tea. Uh, but, again, all that aside, tell me otherwise, how you day been? How are you?
Had you talked to your mother yet? Had you talked to your father or other relatives? Because again, it's the time of year. Hopefully you're relaxing. Hopefully you're enjoying it. And hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. All right. See you tomorrow.